Hi friends, in this video we are going to see how to install Loadrunner 12.55 in your system. Before you begin upgrading or installing the newer version of Loadrunner 12.55, you have to thoroughly uninstall the earlier versions. You can check out my the previous video where I have explained how to do a clean uninstallation of Loadrunner. As you know, Loadrunner comes with 50 virtual users lifetime free license. So to begin the installation, make sure that you have downloaded the complete package of Loadrunner by logging into home.saas.hpa.com slash my account. There you could search for Loadrunner and here you could see there is an option to download the latest version of Loadrunner. By expanding the details, you could see the license is for 50 virtual user. So click on download. Now it is displaying the Loadrunner 12.55 Community Edition software downloads. So here there are a lot of links. So make sure that you have you are downloading the community edition. So it's a zip file, you have to extract it. So before you begin installing the software, make sure that you are right clicking on it and selecting the run as administrator. So this is the uh, first screen. So by default, it goes to temp folder temporarily. So click on install to begin installation. Okay, now you have to select which product you want to install. So in this case, I'm going to select Loadrunner. And you need to accept the terms. And here you could see there's a checkbox participate in Vision Improvement Program. So if you wish to participate, you can check this box. Otherwise, you can uncheck it. So by default, the HP Loadrunner will install in this path. So if you want to change, you can click on change and uh, uh, you can enter the new path. So in this case, I'm going to uh, use the default path. Then you have to click on install. Now it is displaying to enter the certificate details. So I don't have any certificate to attach. So I'm going to uncheck this, clicking on next. So now it is prompting the uh, which type of mode I have to use to install the network virtualization. So I'm going to select typical mode and clicking on finish. Okay. So now it is automatically displaying the what's new in 12.55, which I will be covering in the upcoming videos. Okay. Now we will launch the virtual user generator. So this is the new splash screen of 12.55. Okay. So in upcoming videos, I'll be covering the, the new and new noteworthy of Loadrunner 12.55. So please subscribe to my videos to get a notification. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.